Where? Oh, where? But don't touch it with your hand. You know what? Please. It is the same kind as the other one. So it's probably many of them. Look at him. Let me, let me see if I can get him. Oh, stuck underneath the door. Oh, my goodness. You got my handy dandy clamps. <laughs> Yo, oh, Jesus. Ron. Ron. You know it's on me now. He was going to a cool place. Let me just get. Mm-mm. Oh! That's a little bitty one. I don't give a damn. Look how little he is. Babe. Lord, he finna go upstairs. He going upstairs. He oh! Ron, Ron, he gonna be gone. <laughs> God dog, I'm done without here. I'm done. I am. So, he gonna crawl up in the house. Well, that's, that's one of the ones you gotta kill. Let's just kill him. Did you get him? Oh! <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> Better get his corpse. He's still moving. Oh my goodness. Sorry, Snake, not sorry. What Where is that? Huh? Oh, he's still trying to bite me. He's snapping. Yeah. Meanwhile, you're using a pair of tools. Okay, you ain't picked up nothing, honey. Ain't nothing in there. That is just his tail. No, that's his head. Look at his eye. Hold up. Ooh, a red eye. <laughs> No, that's not and the red. That's his eye. Can you get his whole body though? <laughs> the hair with his eye. He might could grow another head for all we know. What is this over here moving though? What's the? Oh, that's the tail. Is? Bay, do you think it's a lot of them in that shed? No. Why? Why do you think that? Touch that! Oh Jesus! Why would you pick that up with your hands? That's just <laughs> shit is nasty. <laughs> Welcome back to part two. So I left off where we needed to add the rest of the bracing, which is you know all of this. So all of that stuff is complete right now, and we're adding the second joist that'll go right against this one. So it'll be double all the way down that side. And then we can go up here at the top. Um, let me show you the other part that I shared yesterday's video. So this is now done. I showed you this one. This one is now done. And yeah, that's where we are so far with and I'll come back when we get up here on this part and it's hot out here like so hot hot that, this, that You hot? Hell yeah. It's only 86 degrees. That's it. That's it. Not bad at all.
Okay, sis, I need to interrupt this program to bring you some more act funny. I'm back on my act funny-ish, so go ahead and brace yourself, get prepared, and you know how this video is already gonna go. So let me pop this thing open up for you, packaged very well, I might add, and ooh-wee the bubble wrap. You already know I'm about to squeeze the hell out this bubble wrap because why? I'm stressed out. Anyway, that is a Gucci bag. Oh, hi, sis, you see the bag name on the screen that's all you need to know i'll put the style bag on the screen as well but let me go ahead and pop this because that deck got me frustrated okay i'm done popping now look here's the box great condition by the way i have worked with this company before and i can't remember which bags i did with them but i will probably link that down below as well anyway you know how it is you get all your paperwork because we don't ever know when the man might stop us but we ain't about to go through all that because mm -mm, we're gonna jump right into this bag i need to know what's in here what did they surprise me with this time anyway let me go ahead and get this gift bag out because it's part of the whole thing at this point like if you don't send me a bag i'm gonna be upset with you but he always sent a bag so shout out to them so let me go ahead and set that up for you and put the box over here. And let me apologize. My screen blurry. I didn't realize it. I'm sorry. But let's carry on. So anyway, you get the bag. It comes in this dust bag in another package, which is great. So they're making sure you get your package in pristine condition, as you already know. And it just looks like this. And I can tell by the feel of the bag that it's going to be a small bag. But I'm okay with that. Let's jump into it and see what it is. Ooh, la, la. Looky, looky, looky super cute she is tiny honey now listen i can already tell you're not gonna get hardly nothing in her but it's okay because you're gonna be going out on the town with her it's not about carrying a whole bunch of stuff sis it's about looking the part but she cute though she feels good there is the strap to this uh purse right here half chain half um leather material cute clasp the detail it's the detail sis look at how cute and odd shape they are super cute oh yeah the true tell all is gonna be when i put up against my body and see what she looking like when i'm out in these streets acting funny because i already know that i am listen i'm gonna have a link down below for this company of code if they give it to me all that jazz so check down below if you're interested in this bag and we're gonna just jump right on into what she looked like up against my person because that is the true tell-off of these bags. But let me let you admire her for a second. Now, in my opinion, sis, she great, great quality. She's giving great quality. She feels good on my fingertips and she's pretty. Now, she is a mauve color, but you'll see her better when I pair her up so against my body. You say she back acting funny again. Uh-huh, she is. <laughs> She is, sis. Okay, so anyway, let me jump into the bag. So as you can see, this is, I put on something black so that the bag would stand out or how I would actually wear the bag, okay? So as you can see, she got a good crossbody hang. She's stopping in the perfect place for me, for my height, which is 5'7". I'm trying to give you the daytime color of her, which is like a soft mauve rose color is what she's given give you a daytime view of what she looked like up close beautiful um brassy gold um symbol here which is really nice now as i said in the last clip she is definitely only for going out you ain't gonna get a whole lot of nothing in here but you're gonna put in here just what you need okay they're just what you need that's it that's all i am really loving this bag because of the quality and the feel of this bag. She feels different than the other bags. Super cute. If you are a person who definitely don't like big bags, medium-sized bags, and this is your everyday flavor, this bag will be perfect for you because, you know, everybody don't like a big bag. But she is giving. I also like the detail of half of the strap is the leather material, and then the other half is chain. And again, this chain is the exact same material as this. So it's like that high quality brad. Let me know if you are a person who cross bodies your bag on the opposite side of your writing hand. So like I'm right handed and everything cross body got to go to my left. 
easy access. Bam, boom. If you left-handed, do you cross body this way? Or if you right-handed, do you cross body this way? It's just easier for me to get what I need to go, honey, okay? She giving. I am liking this one. Super cute. Super cute. She is a winner. I give this bag a 10 out of 10. And also, I want to reiterate that if you see me out, don't even speak to me, okay? Speak to me when you don't see me with this bag because why? She acting funny. Oh, she acting funny for real. 10 out of 10, sis. 10 out of 10. Link will be down in the description. Any codes, anything I have associated with this bag, sis, I'm going to hook you up, okay? So make sure you check down in the description of this video. And also, you can carry her like this if you want to. Just, you know, top handle top handle carry without the chain strap but i'm this person this is me <laughs> let me go act funny because y'all ain't it today huh -uh. sitting out here on this part last night um, enjoying the nighttime breeze I'm just so ner unnerved now that I've we so many snakes are in my favorite area of the house Ugh. 